hello guys i am back again still updating you with the breaking trending news what is going on in nigeria so wherever you are good morning good afternoon and good evening depending on your location at this time of the day you have seen it all on your screen biafra Igbos not leaving nigeria so that is coming from a boy state governor dev umahi so according to him, he said, despite the agitation for Biafra, Igbos will remain in Nigeria. Umayi spoke to State House correspondent at the presidential villa yesterday, Tuesday. So um, it was during a visit to thank President Buhari for his two days working trip to Ebony on May 5th and 6th. So Umayi said the people were happy with Nigerian leader and appreciate his visit. He dismissed the insinuation that the people of the Southeast were no longer interested in Nigeria. So the governor stated that Igbos were not in support of any form of agitation or plans uh, to secede. So according to him in his word, he said, I have always said that we are not totally in support of agitation to secede. We want to belong to the Nigerian nation. As the chairman of the Southeast Governors Forum, I have publicly said it. I have defended it. I don't care about the attack and those who have taken to the politics of that matter in our place. So that was the statement of Devo Mahi that Igbos are not leaving Nigeria. That the majority of Igbos, um, okay, to you know leave Nigeria, the insinuation that Igbos are no longer interested in Nigeria is a lie. So that is uh, that was the statement of Dev Umahi. Well, uh, personally, I don't know what to add there, but um, for me, my own contribution and opinion. Um, number one, Umahi may be saying this, it is all about politics. Okay, it is all about politics. If only he should prove that Igbos are not uh, interested in Nigeria. Let him prove also that presidency or Igbos will have Nigeria's president. If he thinks that Igbos are happy with Nigeria for being marginalized, let him prove that Nigerian government will give the Igbos presidency. Yes, I believe Omai is speaking for himself because if you do or conduct a referendum now, you realize that a lot of people is tired. If a lot of people, even Nigerians themselves, they are tired of their leaders. Nigerians themselves, they are tired of the country, the nation Nigerians. What about the Igbos that are being marginalized? What makes you think that they prefer to be in Nigeria, they don't want to secede and so on? When after the 1970 civil war, Nigerians have not been able to produce an Igbo president. And you think these people agitating are fools? And you think these people that are agitating do not have sense. I believe he's speaking for himself. But however, let me know what you guys think. See you in another update.